White Walker? You've seen White Walker before? Yeah. Oh, he dude, really? He on me. Rude. He on me as well, yeah. <laughs> Good morning, afternoon, evening. It is Alexis Arcade, and welcome to Arcadia Tours. This week, I'm going to be showing you guys the bases that my patrons have made here on the Arcadia server. They are absolutely awesome and incredible and creative, and I wanted to share them with you because it's a shame that all you've seen so far is just my base. These guys have put so much work into their bases that I had to share them with you, and I can't wait for you guys to see them. So the first base that we have behind me is located here on the map on the center. He's actually done a very, very awesome job of incorporating it into the ruins, because at first look, you just see the ruins, but then when you get into it, oh yeah, it's pretty cool. So let's just fly through here. I'm not going to totally show you yet because it's going to be a surprise. But you can see he's utilized a lot of the steampunk uh, mod that we have here on the server. And it's really, really cool. Let's go ahead and do a fly over. So you can see there's some spikes and stuff. So this base here belongs to Joe. And he's absolutely awesome and hilarious. And he's actually given me a lot of gifts on the server, including this awesome armor that I have on today. So without further ado, let's go ahead and meet Joe and see the tour of his base. All right, you guys, here I am at Joe's place. I am so excited for him to give you a tour. And as you saw in the fly around beforehand, he's got a really unique place here in the ruins. So you ready to give us a tour, Joe? Yep. All right. So should we go in? Yeah, yeah. How's your day been so far? Yeah, pretty good. Uh, I've already found an ascendant blueprint. Oh, oh nice. For what? Shut the door behind. Oh, sorry. Sword. Oh, nice. It's an ascendant sword. Yeah, I just haven't made it yet. So, just, <laughs> uh, so a few dinos in here that I actually use. So, Pelagonus for... What do you use your Pelagonus for? Uh, they're really good at collecting uh, organic power. Oh, I did not know that. They're better than the uh, wolves or sabers these days. Good to know. So uh, the birds here at the front. Uh huh. My uh, resource gatherers. <laughs> uh, and then the Yankees here as well. Nice. Uh, and then my my little greenhouse. Small, but it works. <laughs> yeah, nice. Do you have the uh, the crop gathering guy from S Plus? Uh, no, I don't have that going. I just tend to leave it until I need some and then grab some. Oh, there you go. You have a good irrigation uh, system in there, so. My uh, swanky bed. That is a really nice bed. Oh, man. That's the, <laughs> uh, that's the uh, copper bed from the steampunk mod. That's where the magic happens. <laughs> uh, my Oberaptor. From the egg. One, of oh. my many Ober one, of, one of my many Oberaptors. How many do you have in total? Three? Three? Or okay. four. No, sorry, three. I gave one to Benios. Oh, gotcha. Uh, my little lash rose. Oh. My single dodo. Probably should get her get her a uh, mail at some point. <laughs> a little sleepy person. Oh, so cute. Hi. So cute. That was a, a gift from Sweeney. Yeah, he gave me mm. one too. Did you name your sweet William or did he name your yeah. sweet William? Yeah. No, I, I, I name it. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then we're getting into the crafting stuff over here. Okay. Uh, so I've got my steam steam press up here. This makes me all my oil. Cool. Uh, poo, hide, and spoiled meat, and it just makes oil for me. Very nice. Uh, copper forges, oh. copper grinder. That thing is laggy as all hell. I'm that not thing touching that anymore. Massive. Yeah, and it's so it's kicked me out of the server a couple of times. Oh no! Now. Like, it, like it gives off. Oh so no! Sorry I, I about tend that. to turn it off, and then I oh, know it's, it's fine. It's it's. Everyone says it's incredibly laggy, so I tend to turn it on and then log out anyway. Yeah. Uh, a few more crafting things, more steampunk stuff, a lot of steampunk stuff in this base. Yeah. More steampunk over here. Well, I've got my diamond bit drill. I uh, should have had some gunpowder ready to turn it on, but this one gets me crystal and rare mushrooms. <laughs> okay, that's why you have a ton of rare mushrooms, gotcha. Yeah, and then these are my metal ones over here. Over here. So you can just place these anywhere, and it'll and it'll gather metal on, for you. On any any bit of floor, floor put gunpowder in them, and they get uh, metal and stone. Very a cool. lot more stone than gunpowder as well. Yeah, I still haven't put and down then, the ones you got me yet, because that's going to be a whole other episode. But I'm really excited yeah, to try cool. them out. Then, uh, bulk forges. Nice. 
all sorts of crafting stations, my little bit of storage back here on oh, one nice. single wall. Yeah, I put these foundations down and then then realised I can't actually put any walls up along oh, yeah. the back of them. <laughs> except for that one spot, because they're too close one. to this wall. Well the 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 what's it what's it the ruins wall looks really neat as it is, so Oh, but yeah. you can't place anything yeah. on those. I see. So I can't. Yeah, I can't place the like the cabinets on there. So I've only got six cabinets. So okay, cool. So yeah, so platform smithy assembling station, which I've got all the steel stuff. I haven't played around with that with that yet. Uh, my black cap for my helmet. <laughs> the uh, medical workbench where you get the, the narcotic trip. Oh um, yes, thank you for reminding me about that. Yep. Desk plus crafting, cross pork smithy crafting station, grinder. Egg incubator. And you just put any papers. any egg on it and it's totally fine, right? Yeah, you don't need any form of heat nice. other than that. Just drop an egg, just stand about here and just drop an egg on it. <laughs> I still got my yeah. Giga egg to hatch, so I'm excited about this guy. Yeah. So, uh, and then my S Plus Fabricator, which nice. is brilliant because it's silent and powers off electricity, doesn't need gasoline. Yeah. This is my uh, electrical source for it down here, little crystal. Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the bulk. Your hub's generator. up there, right? Yeah, it's right on the top. We'll, yeah. Uh, probably should go see that in a bit. Uh, meat spoiler, industrial grill, which is also electric, which is great. Uh, glass metal smithy, and then the, the anvil, just perched on the end, because it, it, I accidentally hit it with the demo gun, and then the <laughs> spoiler, yeah. it would snap back on too. So that's my sort of main base, to where I actually sort of use things. It's so uh, cool. So we actually go back outside again to get to the diner pen. Alrighty. My uh, steampunk teleporter. Oh yeah, I, uh, yeah. I would demonstrate, but I it's had an update and I can't actually get it working yet. Oh no. <laughs> so I was working before the update came uh, two days ago, but it's. Uh, we'll check on. Now we're in a bit. Yeah. Yeah, we'll. I'll play around with that a bit more. That was fun. I was teleporting things between mine and Benioff's base, and Sweeney's got one now, and I've got one for your base as well, but you've not quite high enough level to use it yet. Oh, yeah. Yeah. These these gates uh, are so cool. Yeah, that's the Copper Behemoth gate. Wow. Yeah, it's really cool. I do like this. Uh, I've used a lot of the Steampunk mod. I do enjoy it. Yeah. So this is my uh, egg-laying pen. Egg-laying pen. Nice. Basically, it's just all my egg legs. Uh, Packies, parasaurs, Strikes, Stegos, Sarkos, there is an in the single cap rope. I'm still looking for a decent little cap rope to join this later. <laughs> hey, this is a little, little guy over here. Uh, Demetrodons, they are a pain to tame. Oh, yeah. I forget how you tame these guys. Uh, Quetzal Kibble, and the, the torpor drain on these guys is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> they, can drop a they can drop a thousand cut torpor in a minute. Oh, jeez, yeah. Absolutely works. That's not fun. Never over. Never ever after yeah. one of the uh, book troughs. My my derpy dinosaurs, as I like to call them. Does this trough feed your entire area? No, no, I've got uh, four or five back here. Okay. <laughs> my derpy dinosaurs with his Santa hat on. Oh, this is so cute. White Walker, you've seen White Walker before. Yeah. Oh, he dude, just really? on me. Rude. Put it on me as well. Yeah. <laughs> This is his girl here, Rexan. Oh. I went and saved these guys because uh, this is the first Bonto tame on the server, so I couldn't leave him alone out on the in the wild. Oh and, yeah. Um, this is uh, Choco Taco's uh, mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. <laughs> from uh, when we were still at community center. Yeah. Oh, oh, the the one that he kept going. Can we knock that guy out? Can we knock that guy out? Yeah. That's yeah. this is the one right here. <laughs> it was available to claim. I couldn't leave it alone. I had to. I had to bring it to my friend. Yeah. So uh, yeah. And then over here, I've got my uh, lone Dicocalus. I'm looking for another. Oh! But they die. They die so quick. Oh, they're the so cute, though. Yeah, nice red color. Yeah, uh, it is a really neat color, actually. But it's the first one I've sort of been able to actually pick up before it's been killed by Sarkos or. Well, I'll keep an eye out for you because you know they're all near. Oops, I almost punched it. They're all near my base, so. Yeah, most of this lot are in passive back here, so it's fine. Um, my uh, scorpions. Nice. Uh, I like this one's name in particular. A, yeah, uh, Clamp over here was a 150 perfect. Oh, nice. So that's really cool. Yeah. Uh, this is actually Amanda's Kano. Okay. Uh, he, he's 
visiting for breeding purposes okay. at the moment. Because <laughs> uh, my male kind of wasn't incredibly high level. It was That was from the days of the uh, community centre as well. Okay, Carlos. Yeah, but Charlotte <laughs> was uh, 140, 145, something like that. Nice. So, yeah, they're both breeding those two at the moment. Uh, my lone raptor, also from the beginning of the server. I accidentally a killed one. a 150 the other day. Sorry. Yeah, that, that happens. This <laughs> is, um, she was a 120 back when the server was set to maximum 120. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's how long she, she was tamed from. Yeah. But I've kept her alive because I don't really use her. Uh, and then go into the... Over You're here. Got some... Holy cow. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, there's my, over there's my latest uh, over raptor tame. Oh, yeah, yeah. Give me snail. Which I need to go and collect some more sap to feed. Because it's probably starving right now. Yep. Oh, dear. Oh, I didn't know Not they good. eat sap. I thought it was no, just they, the fruit they, they, Yeah, well, I need sap to make more. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Milo's. Nice. Uh, 145. Perfect for Artois over here. Uh, uh, Allison was a little bit only 90, which is okay. Yeah. I can live with that. Uh, Spit fingers. Oh, it looks cute with the, it's the Santa hat on. Uh, it's not got an update, so I can't do the spirit fingers. Oh, it's I, okay. I love doing that. Yeah. Every time I come here, if it's got an update, I do it. I do it. Uh, my uh, galleys. Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> Gilly Fred versus the Myakis, which still not quite sure. I suppose to say the full name. Arca. Archaeopteryx, something like that. Uh, something like that. Yeah. We, yeah. me and Benios went out and tamed them. Like these guys. Uh, this one's bred, I think. Nice. No, that's the one I tamed. That's the one I tamed, that one. Gotcha. And then this one's a red one, then you got good for me. Oh. They look And then used. even more dinosaurs in here. Oh, whoa. Man, this is so cool. This is the wolf den. The wolf? I like it. So this is going to be where I'm going to... I've got their own uh, feeding trough, because this is where I'm going to be breeding, breeding these guys. So I've already yeah. once this... Uh, Girl over here is a, is a baby of those two. Okay. Hundred percent imprint baby. Really nice. nice. I'm not actually certain what level lady is because she's another um, kitten choco dinosaur that okay. I found. I found surviving by itself on the volcano. Thought, oh yeah. Well, that's a strong. That's a strong wolf. Yeah, I'll, for real. <laughs> Um, last but not least, oh, my little copper walling over there. Oh man, yeah, that's awesome. So last on this level is the Gigapen. The Gigapen. Yep, yep. And when I came in here the other day, there were like a ton of eggs on the ground. Yeah, these three ladies at the back here, because there's four females, one male in here. Yeah. These Whoa. three ladies at the back here are only just out of the egg collector's range. Oh, okay. So they're out. Yeah. This lady in the front, that always gets collected. <laughs> it's funny how that works. Egg. Egg, 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 egg. Like the size of you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so that's it for down here. Nice. It's very cool. Um, very unique. I haven't got a bird back here, so we're going to have to go outside and look. All right. Unless my my bird's out in front of the beach anyway. Unless you got grapple hooks. I do not. Of course I don't. <laughs> Because <laughs> I usually use a grapple hook to go up to top. Oh, that's creative. And back down again and stuff. So, we'll, we'll go the long way around. Okay. So, up, up these steps here. So, I'm uh, playing around with the uh, copper stuff on this Oh, wow. That stuff. looks so cool, Joe. And uh, I love this gate because it's the you have to look at the lever to get it to go up and down. Oh, neat. On the, on the side of it. Gosh. Yeah, so I was playing around with the copper stuff in this, the bubbling pipes and all this lot. And the yeah. Work. I was going to do the rest of the. Go ahead. I was going to do the rest of the arches, but then I realised that the, the amount of lag that this was causing by itself, uh, so I left it. It's just a nice little. Yeah. Fun bit to do. Uh, there's nothing else around the front, so I'll go up this staircase. So this is directly above my crafting area, and I normally just shoot a grapple hook up here on the <laughs> ceiling. Grapple all the way up. My uh, steampunk construction yard where I've been making all the teleporters. Oh, nice. 
uh, possibly make the hot air balloon at some point, but uh, I've left it. There's no room to put that down with the rest of the crafting, so we have to come up with it. Yeah, it would look cool up here, the hot air balloon. Mm -hmm. yeah, and then, quet storage. Quet storage, nice. My four quetches, I've still got an egg downstairs to hatch. Which is... What happened to Quet in the first? Quet in the first was the one that died in the to the Mesopith. Oh, yeah, the sorry about that. <laughs> Meg sorry. You know, mine's still missing. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, well, uh, Quent in the first was exact same colors, exact same level when tamed, so uh, it had to be Quent in the second. Oh, yeah, so. it was meant to be. Uh, and then Sarah was another another tame out of the box. There's been lots of Quetches tamed in that box. And that box. <laughs> This box over here, Farming yeah. of Quetzal, Washington. Yeah. The original, the original Quetz. The, the, the OG Quetz. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. And then this is the one I raised the other day. One of the uh, two at this one. Oh, I like your name. This is 100% imprinted. Oh my word! It takes a while. I believe that. Five hours to. At least you're able to. I'm glad the tame times are good enough so that you're able to imprint. Yeah. Yeah. Imprinting was fine. Good. And then. Back here, I've got the uh, back staircase out onto the. Oh yeah, man! That goes back out onto the beach. This place is just Should so. Probably put a put a, probably put a gate on here somewhere. Really, but I uh, haven't bothered. If nothing comes up, it. Yeah. So. You could put like maybe decoration here on this landing. I don't know. Yeah. But it's already so cool. What a like, just neat spot you picked here. Yeah, well, I I've played the center a few times. I knew it was here. I knew it. Are you going to keep the center main beaten. base? Do you plan on making another one? or? Uh, I'll probably do some building projects in the future, but yeah. I'll probably keep this. Yeah, definitely schnazzy. Who's, whose little place is that right there? Hmm? The stone walls over there? Oh, that's um, a taming pen for me. Oh, okay. We nice. can go have a look at that if you want. Sure. Uh, we'll jump on Quetzal Washington because he can stand on the back on the on the box. All right. So I did have my uh, taming pen in the Dino pen, but it kind of got a little full to keep it oh. there. <laughs> so I I built this one with gotcha. the uh, and uh, uh, this is my um, my sacrificial rexes I've lined up protrudons. Oh, nice. So yeah. That one just laid naked. up in there. Hmm? The far one. Uh, over there, they've been playing, playing some eggs for me, which is <laughs> kind of nice. I don't really need any more eggs. I've got, but yeah, so you've got a, a solid egg breeding unit going on. Yeah, well, I've got the, the, the mated pair of Rexes over there, probably. Very, very oh, cool, good. Joe. Trying to knock you off on a pillow as we go in. Oh, totally fine. Yeah. Whoop! Yeah, follow that man. <laughs> Where did so that's my stairs? base. I love it. Did we already go up these stairs? Uh, this is just another way around to the construction. Oh, yard. right, right, right. Okay, okay. So, so this cool. goes on a this goes on a loop. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's my uh, my power supply up here as well. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. My art corrector. Oh, I don't know why I just did that. Well, yeah. thank you, Joe. Oh, gee. Oh. <coughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> well, you know. I enjoyed that. Well, thank yeah. you for giving me a tour of your place. It's awesome. All right. It's uh, fairly minimalist in the building works. So I'm not gone crazy like some people but no but I, the copper oh. like it makes me want to redo the hotel with the copper stuff so like that was really this stuff's awesome like it looks really good yeah the copper too. stuff is looks really good there's a lot more to it i haven't really played around with yet yeah but definitely gonna do uh some more yeah well right on thank you for having me all right
So there you have it, the grand tour of Mr. Joe's place built here into the ruins. Once again, totally awesome. He nailed it out of the park with this one. It is so unique and original, and I never in a million years would have thought to build here. So thank you again, Joe, for having me and showing myself and subscribers around here on your base. So if you guys like the video, please leave a comment and a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. That way you can see more of the Arcadia tours and more content we put out here on the channel. You guys have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you later. Bye!